Excuse me. Yes? You shouldn't be here alone. This area is overrun with marauders and thieves. It's not safe. Thieves? Yes. Rottenbaum Village has been attacked repeatedly by armored marauders. Oh, by the way, my name is Wayne Cruz. I'm a knight of Bernstein Kingdom, and these are my associates. It's very kind of you to take an interest in me. It's my sworn duty. Well, it's sweet just the same. Oh, by the way, my name is Arietta. Well then, Arietta, if you are traveling through here, can we escort you to ensure your safety? My, you are a kind knight, aren't you? However, I shall be perfectly safe. Sarab shall see to that, right, Sarab? Uh... I see. Take care then. Uh, you too, Sarab. Come, Sarab. We should be going. Farewell, Wayne. She was pretty hot, wasn't she? <gasps> Pig? That is inappropriate talk from a supposed professional servant of the king. I was just warning her that this was a dangerous area and that she shouldn't travel alone. What was her response? 
She thanked me for my concern, but assured me that her wolf could defend her if necessary. My question is, what is she doing here in the first place? As Wayne and the party moved through the forest, a heavy rain began to fall. Looking for shelter, they noticed a small cabin nearby. With few other options, it was quickly decided to use it for refuge. It was soon discovered that a young man with a calm demeanor was living there. It looks like the rain has stopped. It's so nice now. It's hard to believe it was just pouring. Good thing this cabin was here, or we'd still be cold, wet, and miserable. Thank you for your hospitality. There's no need for thanks. I should probably thank him too, but he's just so... quiet. Hey, you say that like it's a bad thing. It's not. Hey! Are you talking about me? Why? Do you think I am? <laughs> yeah, and I don't like it. That face seems so familiar. What's the matter, Captain? I... I remember seeing him before. I believe he's... Sir Ernest Lyle, a former Imperial Knight. <laughs> what? That was Sir Lyle? And how would you know what he looks like, Charlo? I'm striving to become an Imperial Knight myself. Of course I know what they look like. Besides, I met him at a palace function my father attended. You mean, parties? You partied with him? I never expected to see Sir Lyle in a place like this. Oh, oh, I have a question. What's an Imperial Knight doing living here? It's not even in Bernstein Kingdom. <sighs> Don't you know anything? I'm only going to tell you this once, so you'd better listen up. Don't you remember the revolt against the government a year ago? Sir Lyle fought against Bernstein Kingdom. After Venzern was defeated, Sir Lyle could have been given the death sentence. However, King Elliot ruled that he merely be expelled. Oh, uh, right, uh, yeah. So what now, Captain? I don't intend to act on this information at the moment. Sir Lyle is living his life quietly in exile. We have no right nor reason to disturb that now. We've already lost too much time here. Let's continue on.